Hey what's up guys it's Mac and we're back with another tech video and today we're going to unbox this AMW A10 LHR Sports Bluetooth headphone. We're going to check what do you get in the box, the headphone physical overview, features, audio quality and we're also gonna be recording some mic tests. So if you're interested stay tuned and watch the video. MKB Cult has the best mesh made weapons with texture materials, unique effects, and special powers for your avatar. Make sure you visit our Second Life Marketplace at the link in the description below. I was surprised by the packaging, I didn't expect it to be fancy as this one for its price. It has a magnetic cover that you can flip in order for you to see what you get inside. Obviously, you get the Bluetooth headphone, the USB to micro USB for charging, two extra earbuds, and some documentation. The design is minimalistic and not too flashy. It has a rubber material on each earpiece shape for everyone's ear. The earbuds are soft and it feels squishy for comfort for a long period of time of use. The cable is flat and short to keep it from getting tangled. Apparently, you can choose from 5 different colors according to your taste. Unfortunately, there is no plain black or white color. This Bluetooth headphone has an English voice reminder with Chinese accent. You can actually see the battery status on your screen when you pair it with an iPhone or iPad. Unfortunately for Android, you have to rely on the flashing color indicator or the voice reminder. The battery capacity has 80 milliampers. Normal music playtime or call time is up to 6 hours. According to the box, you need at least 1 hour and 5 minutes to charge it. And you can be as far as 10 meters from your device using this headphone. If you go beyond it, it will be unpairing itself or disconnecting itself from your device. To pair this headphone on your device, you need to press this button for a couple of seconds. Then you'll see an interchanging flashing blue and red light. Search for the other devices on your phone, iPad, or PC and look for AMW810. The flashing blue and red light will stop when it is connected. And if you're wearing the headphone while pairing, you will hear a voice reminder that it was connected. Long pressing the middle button turns the headphone on and off, and a quick one will answer phone calls. Long pressing the top button turns the volume up, and a single press proceeds to the next song if you're playing music. The same idea goes for the last button. As for the audio quality, I think it's fair. It doesn't have this amazing sound factor, but not bad for a wireless headphone. Now, let's check out the mic quality. This is the sound of mic while calling. It is recorded OBS to you without any audio enhancement. Overall, in my opinion, I think it's a decent Bluetooth headphone and good for music, but not for calling. If you're planning to get one of these as your daily driver for calling, I suggest look for something else. But if you want some wireless headphone just for music, I would say go for it. If you found this video interesting, give us a thumbs up and share it. If you want some more slips, subscribe as well as follow our socials down at the link in the description. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.